People always talk about the Aggie ring. That is my most prized possession. Aggies can spot that ring across a crowded hallway, across an airport, and it often opens the door to conversation and to professional collaborations. It is your ticket, your golden ticket to the world. An Aggie is someone who identifies with the core values of Texas A&M and embraces those values and lives those values. When an Aggie hires another Aggie, they're hiring someone that they know obviously is going to be well equipped to perform the job. They're hiring someone that they know is going to be respectful. They're hiring someone that they know has kind of been in this yes ma'am, no ma'am culture that I think is really valuable and kind of gets overlooked sometimes. Aggies open the door for other Aggies professionally because they know that they're coming equipped with core values, with a work ethic that is willing to roll up your sleeves and do whatever it takes. We obviously have a military background and it's a big kind of pulse to who we are. That self-discipline and that leadership that they learn here in the core, they can apply that to the real world. Miss Rev, uh, she <laughs> She's the first lady of Texas A&M. She outranks everybody. If she gets in my bed, I'll sleep on the floor. She kind of serves as an emblem as the way that we as Aggies are kind of supposed to treat each other. We put her needs before all of our needs. Someone coming to this university can tap into that Aggie network and go just about anywhere. Alums are expected to help other Aggies. They can look at the resumes in advance uh, they can actually role play with our young alums to get them into the organizations, to open doors to other alums. That's an expectation. Aggies are faithful to each other because everybody just has that loyalty and that pride about their school. Texas A&M really does um, create effective people out in the world. We have this little question that we ask a lot of folks, what do you call an Aggie in five years? Boss. <laughs>